Often we get requests or get asked by clients whether we can zone every single separate room in the house as a separate zone. And so let me tell you about how you can do this and why you might not want to do it. Hey, it's Phil from Euroheat here. And because we've been designing and installing hydronic heating and cooling systems in WA for almost 30 years, we've gotten to see our clients, you know, before they uh, uh, you know, move into their house, when they're in the planning stage, when they're in the construction stage, and after they move in, and five and 10 and 20 and 30 years after they've actually you know, been living in the house. And because of this, what we've noticed is a few distinct patterns. And one of them is that generally if they have six or eight or 10 zones in their you know, house, however large it may be, that what they do is over time, they actually, all the thermostats, they end up being set up pretty much the same. So they turn off at the same time, turn on at the same time, have generally the same temperatures. And why that is, is because with hydronic floor heating systems, if they are designed and installed correctly, the running costs are low, but they're also very sort of uh, comfortable and ambient in the background. You don't really notice. It's not like turning on a, a heater in the corner of the room and then it gets really hot and then you turn it off because you get too hot and sweaty and then you know an hour later you have to turn it back on again. It just sort of does its thing automatically in the background. And you notice if you walk into one room which is not heated, you automatically notice that. Because the, the comfortable, the, the pleasant feeling is no longer there. And so even if people, you know, they want to do the right thing, they do want to save energy, they want to, you know, perhaps turn it off in some parts of the house. What we actually recommend is, if you have a very large house, a very large single story house, we perhaps recommend splitting it into two and having two zones. Uh, or if you have a two story house, having, you know, one, one zone for each, each level. And if, for example, one of your rooms, your, your kids move out or you have a guest room which is hardly ever used, what you can do is you can just simply go to the manifold and like a tap, turn that particular zone off. And why that's better is because it generally costs a lot of money to add an extra zone to your floor heating system because there's an extra thermostat required, there's more, there's cabling required. Then if you want you know, to add one zone, it's not just onto that particular floor heating loop. You have to do it for basically everyone. So you have to buy all the components for all the loops and the costs start adding up pretty quickly. So from an economy point of view and also from uh, you know, knowing our clients for decades, we generally suggest you keep the level or uh, amount of zones and thermostats to a minimum and that way you are happy for decades to come. So once again, we would recommend if you are installing a floor heating system into your house, don't zone every room separately like with a thermostat. Try and zone your house into large sections. Depending on the design of your house, it, it might be uh, uh, appropriate to do that according to the um, you know the sun loads or uh, the operation like you know how many occupants are in the house and how that you're going to use the house but definitely it, there's no point in, in zoning each room independently with its own thermostat timer because then it just adds cost and complexity to your system. So if you would like help with designing a, a, an energy efficient floor heating system that is easy to control and runs by itself automatically, at Euroheat we've been doing it for almost 30 years and we'd really like to help you with your system too. So send us an email with your plans and with your ideas and then we can have a look through them and we can get back to you with how and, and if we can help you for your particular project.